My name is Simon Ricks and I am race director of this event. Okay, sir. And uh, my first question would be, uh, I mean, in a simple terms and ask you explain to like, to like normal people, like people who have like no knowledge about jet ski at all or very little knowledge about jet ski. So how is the race evaluated and scored? Uh, the race is evaluated and scored by laps. How many times you make it around the, the, the track. Yes, sir. Um, we have a tower with our qualified scorekeepers who lap count every run number on every lap. Yes, sir. And depending on the, the class or the category, uh, determines the number of laps that the, the riders are mandated to go around. Um, once that is completed, as long as there are no penalties along that, on that rider, um, the scores are tallied and whoever finishes first takes first place, whoever comes in behind them, second, third, fourth, and consecutively on down the line. So uh, correct me if, if I'm wrong, sir. This, this race is called the uh, Runabout uh, Endurance, is it correct? Yep. Yes, and uh, it's uh, 30 minutes. So, right. like, um, so uh, riders who score the most right will win or something like that? Sir? Yes, who, whoever scores the most laps. Mm -hmm. um, it's a 30 minutes, so they, as lo many laps as they can complete in 30 minutes. Um, yes, and, and that's uh, after the 30 after the 30 minute time, you have one more lap to complete, and then then the race is over. Okay, sir. And also, like the variables. So, for example, the wind speed, or you know, the size of the uh, you know the, the the watercraft engine, and you know, also you know, down to like uh, the weight of the athlete. Does it count in the score or not? No, it does not count in the score. Um, that all um, that all matters on rider ability. Yes, so there, there's different boats with different horsepower ratings. Um, for waves this big, yes. uh, you do not need a boat with a lot of horsepower oh. because you cannot reach top speed in waves like this. Okay. So you, you need one that's got less horsepower but more reliable okay, to, to make the, the completion of the race. And what are some of you know uh, some of the mistakes that allow you know the riders to have uh, to have the penalty? Like, what what are what are the chances that they can can get a penalty? For example, uh, penalty can be for missing a buoy. So if they go on the wrong side of the, the buoy course, um, that will count as a penalty. Um, if they, if they fall off their boat, yes, they, they penalize themselves because it, it takes time for them to get back to their, their jet ski. Um, and the endurance race like that, uh, buoy calls are most penal, uh, the biggest penalty we'd have. Yes, sir. And uh, the, race, uh, the race just now, sir, how do you feel about it? Uh, do you see, like, is it going well? And which country do you think is going, like, better than the other, like, so far? Not, not sure yet. Um, the, the race went exceptionally well with the water conditions. Yes, sir. Uh, it's very challenging for the riders. Uh, the riders like it like that. Mm -hmm. uh, Indonesia did very well in the endurance race. Yes, um, in other categories uh, for the, the closed course racing, uh, I know Cambodia is doing very well uh, and Thailand is doing very well. Yes, sir. And just now, just one last question, sir. Just now the sky was very dark mm -hmm. and it, it rained a bit. So uh, were you worried? No, as long as we do not have lightning, uh, we're not worried. We have raced in rain before. Oh. Um, okay. But rain, rain is not a factor unless it's a, a very serious downpour, but any light rain, that's not an issue. As long as we do not have lightning, if we do have lightning, we will stop racing. So lightning can, like, elect electric shoot the athlete? Oh, absolutely. Lightning is very dangerous, no matter where you are. Okay, but okay, especially sir. being on the water, uh, and uh, the rider is elevated from the water, so lightning takes the shortest path. Yes, sir. So they, they may, it may take a path to a rider, yes, so sir. we cannot take that chance. Yes, sir. And is it your first time here in Cambodia? Uh, my first time in Cambodia, yes. Ah, okay, sir. But I've, I've worked many races in Thailand. Yes, sir. Um, but uh, first time Cambodia, very beautiful country. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank right. you so much. Thank you very much. Yes, yes.